Here we are outside the National Affairs Office in Dublin, the National Affairs Office of the Church of Scientology. This is an organization that at the moment is trying to set up a narcanon center in a tiny little village called Balaiver. Balaiver has 1,700 members. That's all they have in the village, 1,700 people. Janet Laveau from OSA was actually um, on the radio two or three days ago. Lying. And lying? Fuck it, I'll tell you what, mate, I've never heard so much tripe in all my life. So, Narcanon killed. Scientology kills. There's no doubt about this. It's time we make a stand. Time we make a stand. And just in case you think I'm a fucking hiding, give you a, I'll tell you what you need is a hiding. Scientology is a really dangerous cult. Scientology is a dangerous cult. It's great. What did, you, did you see the did you hear the radio podcast? Fantastic, wasn't it, eh? Yeah. John Laveau. Laveau. <laughs> Never, ever, ever, anywhere else in the world have we ever had opposition against Narconon. That's why it's banned in Canada. It was failed recently in the UK by the uh, Quality Care Commission too, yeah, and she also lied about that. She lied about that. And Nick said a phone in Australia in the chat run. Yeah, come on guys, try and tell the truth. Just for once, tell the truth. Scientology is an insidious, dangerous cult. God, well, they just look at it. They don't want to talk to anybody. They won't tell anybody the truth. Yes, I know. The Vedad Sidwani. I know. Yeah. The Vedad Sidwani. This is a message to all the Latinos in the States who are crossing the border to get green cards from the Church of Scientology. The Vedad Sidwani. Jana Dovu, you must go. Jana Dovu. You are a lying bitch! Let's send Janet to another planet. Target 2, we don't want you. Target 2, we don't want you. Janet, go to another planet. Here comes trouble. Hello, John. What I says, no! What I says, no! What I says, no! Back your bags and go! It's really hard to watch. Alive assist! Alive assist! Alive assist! Alive assist! Back your bags and go! Back your bags and go! Alive assist! No! They say that Narcanon does not use Scientology practices or counsel. These are lies. Janet Laveau, you're a liar. Narcanon buys all of its books from the Scientology Bridge Company, Bridge Publications, and the money floods back into Scientology coffers. This is a lie, Janet. The Church of Scientology does make a profit out of Narcanon. And the other lie is the books that are presented to the students. They are students, according to the Church of Scientology. These students who go for cures at $30,000 a pop, or euros if you prefer, right? These people spend a fortune, an absolute fortune, on a bogus cure, a quack cure that doesn't work. Now, Janet Laveau stated categorically that this is the only place where they've ever had problems worldwide. No one's ever stood up to knock on before. But that's really strange, because Narconon is banned in Canada. And if you go to Australia, Nick Xenophon from the Senate is fighting against Narconon. And in Germany, they're against Narconon. And Narconon has caused deaths, untold deaths, all across the world. And now they want to come to Ireland, to your fair city in Dublin. And they've just set up in a place called Fur House on the outskirts of Dublin. 
where they have 145 members who are here to indoctrinate the Irish public. Thank you. 